Ladies and gentlemen, damas y caballeros, mesdames y messieurs, it is with great pleasure that we present to you the third Fossil of the Day Award here in uh, beautiful Lima, Peru. Because we have our podium now. Ooh. Thank you. And as many of you know, uh, the Fossil of the Day Award is given daily at the COPS by Can International uh, to reward uh, the country that has done the most to be the worst, that has tried the hardest to be the baddest, and uh, gone the fastest at slowing things down. Um, and as many of you know, uh, we begin each day with the traditional Fossil of the Day song. So I would like to invite all of you uh, to join me in this song, and the lyrics are written right there, so there's really no excuse not If you please. To begin today's fossil, um, we're going to slow things down and step back. I know for many of you this is the first cop, and things can get really confusing. Like, WTF is ADP IDK. So, um, to help navigate us through this, we have a special guest, Victor, who will be teaching us a little bit about uh, UN counting mechanisms, specifically around CDM. Contando dedos de manos. Victor, if you please. Big round of applause for Victor. Victor, would you like to please show us something about the CDM counting? Yeah. Um, so, it's easy. I will show you ten fingers. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> but Victor, it seems like there's actually only five fingers there. No. But I, I, I but I'm, it's, I can't. It's ten. But, uh, CDM. <laughs> okay, whatever you say, Victor. <laughs> but this does bring us to today's first fossil of the war, fossil of the day. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen. Today's first fossil of the award is awarded to Brazil. 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 And why? Is given because Brazil stated in the framework for various that there is no double counting in the CDM. As numerous scientists have documented, double counting of emissions is a serious problem with New robust accounting rules that stamp out such practices are seriously needed to ensure the integrity of our efforts to combat climate change. This statement undermines climate action and earns Brazil a second place fossil. Right this way. And as long as you're double counting, we're going to give you two of these. <laughs> And pin this on here. Okay, thank you. So everybody now is a little bit clearer on CDM counting, correct? Yes. Fantastic. We can do it again if that yeah. if we need it done twice. Brings us forward to today's number one fossil winner. Some of these things are pretty complicated. And this one has to do a lot with commitments. So I want to tell a personal story about my first big commitment, which is when I decided to buy my first car. It was a shiny red car, a Volkswagen. I'll remember it always. 
um, quite in the middle, but, uh, you know. But, and here, I'd like to invite a special, the fossil winning delegation to come out and try out a car with us. So, uh, welcome. If, if, if you want to try out this car, um, it's, we're selling it today. Um, I'm rather new in this whole emissions productions thing. Um, I know you have a lot of experience with it, but, um, but I thought maybe you could try out the car, and then if you like it, we can talk about commitment and what that might actually mean. <laughs> See? Um, okay. And, so, as many of you know, here we are in Lima. Let's just go for a spin around the block. <laughs> me, 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 me. <laughs> <laughs> me, 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 Okay, here we are. We've uh, successfully gone around the block. Uh, it took a little longer than expected, I'm sorry. But, uh, so, w what did you all think of the car? ready to financially commit to this. Oh, fantastic. A financial commitment would really help out um, my new business in developing. Um, so, well, um, great. So if we want to move this forward, I've got... Um, all you have to do is um, sign here, and then we'll have it be legally binding. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I mean, we really like the car and everything, but we're not going to sign a legally binding contract. If you're not going to sign a legally binding contract, then what kind of commitment is this? Well, I mean, we really like it, but what if we change our mind in the future? I mean, what if we don't like it anymore or we can't afford it? Well, if you change your mind in the future is precisely why I want a legally binding contract to protect myself. Look, my developing little friends, if you make a sign that legally binding contract, the entire deal might be... Ladies and gentlemen, this brings us to tonight's first prize fossil winner. Drum roll, please. Thank you. Tonight's first prize fossil award goes to Switzerland. Why? Place fossil of the day for as anyone who listens to civil society or a climate scientist will know, we have much, we have to do much more if we want to keep temperature rise within the internationally agreed threshold of two degrees Celsius. Predictable public climate finance to help developing countries to scale up their climate actions will help grease the ambition wheel. Switzerland not only opposed any legally binding commitment of finance, but also threatened developing countries that any demand for here in Lima. Other developed countries, EU and the US, came close to earning a fossil too. So watch out. <laughs> As they didn't exactly paint, paint themselves in glory either, when they also strongly rejected commitments on finance. Ladies and gentlemen, can we hear a resounding boo? boo. And you can take your place on our brand new podium. Put all three of them up there. <laughs> Tonight's fossil award ceremony does not win here. It does not end here. There's a surprise. What could come after the first prize winner? Ladies and gentlemen, in very rare circumstances, can International awards something we call a ray of the day to actually does something good. It, it's very rare. <laughs> but today is one such case, and I have the pleasure of awarding our special guest a ray of the day to Oasis, Aosis. <laughs> a big round of applause, please. <laughs> yes. Aosis received the ray of the day award today 
report during this COP the complete phase out. What an idea. <laughs> what makes the statement even more powerful is that other countries added their voice to that of ILAC, I don't know how to pronounce that one, and Norway, achieving this phase out of fossil fuel emissions and a just transition to 100% renewable energy by mid century is a low two degrees threshold. Countries also need to ensure that there's enough financial and technological support to have developing countries achieve transition. Shifting investments and subsidies from fossil fuels to renewable energy is a good start. Ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for AOSIS, please. Thank you. This concludes today's fossil ceremony. We will be here tomorrow and every day at 6 p.m. for your daily dose of sanity. Um, but before we end, we'd like you to join us one last time in singing the Fossil of the Day song. Maestro, if you please. <coughs> Oh,